Hello, the type of my show. And yeah, I don't think I waited long enough to start saying that. I lost my sword, that's not good. But there's more. There's another sword right there. So I'm gonna go pick that up after I beat this guy up. And this girl. Whatever. How come my punches hit her right there? That's video game logic. Punching her when I'm yellow works. Except. Except. Uh, don't fall again. Oh, whatever. Is there another sword? Yes, there is. There's two. It'd be awesome if I picked up two swords. Listen to the music for a little while. The awesomeness of Anamonaguchi. Anamonaguchi is really cool. Like in person, they seem really cool. I remember at first, and I was like, when he like when the when the singer, what not the singer, when, like one of the guys um, in the band like taught, like got the mic to introduce himself. I was like, but he talks, he can speak, and it was hilarious. Um, let's buy some stuff. Let's buy some yummy ramen. That's the most expensive ramen ever. I, I used to pay like, what, 20 cents for ramen? Yeah. And all this stuff looks delicious. Subspace door. Okay, thanks, bye. <sighs> a subspace highway? Of course, it's a subspace highway. Pigs that fly and make money. And coin blocks. <laughs> I love this game. Feels good to be playing it again. It's one of those games that I'll probably keep playing until, like, forever. I never get tired of it. Flying pigs! Woohoo! Keep forgetting I have all these, like, really strong moves, and I, like, never use them. Oh well. I'm getting by fine without them. So where are we now? We have more awesome music. Chengdu Gardens. This place wasn't in the books either, I don't think. At least we go back to the books by the time we get the boss. By, by the time we get to the boss, yeah, we're back at where the books go. Books are. Where. I should, you really use some. You actually use some of these moves. They're good. They're really strong. What's back here? Nothing. It's probably where you start off if you don't take the subspace highway. I don't remember. I'm sure I haven't taken it. I've beaten the stage at least four times. Not six times though, because I well, yeah, five times actually, because um, I've gotten past here with knives. I haven't beaten with the knives, I've been having trouble with Gideon with the knives, but I'll beat it when I feel like it. I haven't gotten far with uh, Nega Scott though, which is the un other unlockable character. Sorry if that's spoiling it for you guys, but if you unlock, if you uh, beat, the beat the game with the four normal characters you already have, like uh, Scott, Ramona, Kim, and St um, Stills, you unlock Nega Scott. He's not really that much different from uh, Scott, normal Scott. He's a little stronger, and he doesn't have as much uh, guts points. I think that's what they're called, I don't remember. Something like that. But yeah, he's pretty cool actually, he's just like a grave or we'll fight him late. Spoiler alert, we'll, we'll fight him in a little bit. Next boss, no, one after this next one. Hey, that's a rose quest, I never noticed that was there before. Let me take your money and go. Red ninjas. I don't think red is a very good color for a ninja, for a ninja to be wearing, but hey, orange isn't one either. I mean, I used to love Naruto. There's like no Naruto references in this. That seems like there should be. What other reference? What? Or a Ninja Gaiden? Well, Ninja Gaiden reference. They sh there should be a Ninja Gaiden reference. There should be like a bird coming down right here to try to kill me. But we see those later, which is probably a Ninja Gaiden reference. So hey, a subspace door. Let's go in. Oh, I dropped my sword. Oh, I just noticed there's like zeros and ones inside the um, subspace door, and it's all snowy again magically. Even by the sound of the books, it's like spring, I think. But whatever. Try to get as much money as we can, even though I don't really need it. After this, I'm gonna go see if I can pay off my fine and see if I can uh, see what I can buy with that. Because I've never paid off my fine in the store before. I've always had been buying power-ups and such, but now I have enough money to pay it off. So let's do it. I'll buy like a ton of lives if I have enough money afterwards, which I probably won't. Why does the video store sell lives? That'd be an awesome. I'd want to go to that video store. I'd be like, hey, um. Yeah, I won this movie, and yeah, ten lives, please. Then if I if I scare myself to death watching the movie, I could just have another life. That'd be awesome. But then again, if people had like could buy more than one life, then I'm sure like the people that are seen like is really evil and that need to die, like Hitler and stuff. Um, this is gonna sound really stupid, but then they would buy, like, buy tons of lives, and then we would have to kill them so many times, and they just they just keep buying lives, and they'd never die. 
So yeah, we're back. We're in Ramona's backyard magically. This makes sense if it's in the like in, in the books. This makes sense, but here it doesn't. So we're just gonna like taunt and pick up this radish. I'm like Princess Peach. Roxy Richter, Ramona's fourth year old ex evil ex-boyfriend. Gender female. That was not on desync. It actually might be desync, but I did read, finish reading it after a few. Um, after it went away, so this is Roxy Richter. She is a ninja. Well, she's half ninja. And she will murder you if you're not careful. And don't have a turn up. Random cat. This music is awesome, too. On Monic Gucci does a, did a really good job with the music for this game. I remember when they were like, oh, yeah, this song is from a little game called Scut. I remember when uh, they were like, then they were, uh, I need to stop getting my tongue tied. When they were um, introducing the Scott Pilgrim Anthem song, they were like, okay, this song's from a game called Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, and everyone's like, woo! And I was like, woo! And it was awesome. And KO! Yeah. Watch this, guys. Some of you might be. They, she explodes into animals that turn into money once you pick them up. That's so awesome. What if current, the currency was animals? That'd be pretty cool. But that's a, that's a reference to uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. Because in the Sonic Hedgehog games, when you kill an enemy, they turn into animals. Oh, yeah. Come on, how much did we get? Oh, 121. Oh, that's a lot. 121 dollars. Seems like you get more money in this game than you used to. Maybe they updated it. I think. I love this one. I love all the cutscenes in this game. They're all so cute. They should have made that mask, that moon in the background, the one that looks like looked like the moon in Majora's Mask. That would have completely ruined it, but, but it would have been so awesome. 